Hello and welcome everyone to the walk around video here at your next car, the 2019 1600 G20 330EM Sport. The car is presented in Porto Mile Blue, features the Y&Z body enhancement kit alongside some nice options and features. How you see the car is how you'll purchase it and if you'd like to know more you're welcome to use the links that are available in the description box. As always let's get into talking about the vehicle itself. It has got the brand new 20 inch alloys with four brand new tires we have also added our front splitter and matching kidney grills side cell extensions and y&c and performance decals aero mirror caps spoiler and the diffuser we're going to come on to talk a, a little bit about the 330e's hybrid capabilities and of course show you around the interior shortly Round at the back, we've got the spoiler and diffuser. If you'd prefer to upgrade the diffuser to one of our quad exhaust diffusers, which you may or may have not seen, check out the fifth or sixth image along in the advert pictures, and you can see all of the details about those. And if you want to see one in a video, just check back through the channel. There is plenty of our G23 series with those quad exhaust diffusers on. So you can see one in a video, and then call us up to look up further ask about the details for the upgrade but let's get in and show you the boot space then and of course laid out on display is the supplied bmw charger this makes things nice and simple as you can see it's a regular three pin socket so you'd be more than used to that by now and again it makes accessibility fairly simple you've got folding seats to make up for the slight bit of boot depth loss of course it's more than made up for for the fact that you have got that ability to run on a pure electric at the passenger side again you can see just how neat and tidy this car has been kept it benefits from the rear privacy glass inside it has got the unique interior as you can see there it's a real real difficult interior to get to show up properly in the light of the camera or even a video but again it is a very very nice sort of dark chocolate brown and it's the Venetsky leather and it looks really good with this blue it is that unique factor so I'm sure will stand out and appeal to a good amount of people it's always nice to have that unique factor when buying a new vehicle as you can see there again it goes right the way through to the door cards but isn't extended to the dash or even the carpets heated front seats you've got ambient lighting as well and if we pop open that, this is where you'll put the ch charger into the vehicle. And again, it really is nice and easy. Charge time takes around about three to four hours if the batteries are completely empty. And again, that will vary on how and where you are charging. Obviously, fast chargers are becoming more and more frequent and easier to access now. You can't, can even have one installed at your home. They are relatively inexpensive as well. If we hop inside then, before we go any further, we'll talk a little bit about electric range. BMW give you a claimed estimated range of around about 37 to 40 miles of electric range. Now, again, that will vary on driving style and driving conditions. It's covered just over 13,000 miles this car, so it's another lovely low mileage example. As you can see here, we've got the touchscreen nav and media setup, which makes using this really user friendly you can see it's given me points of interest including both petrol and electric hookup stations there so again really simplifies the usage of this car it'll even tell you whether a it's relevant to use this charging station for this car or if it's available or not i.e if somebody else is using it as you can see you can swipe effortlessly between customizable screens Multimedia, you've got tons of that. You've got DAB, music collection, Bluetooth, screen mirroring, and USB lining. We have also got Apple CarPlay for this car, as you can see there. And if we back away from there, we'll check out some of the service status. Obviously, it's such a low mileage car. It's not to have many services and isn't due one for 12,000 miles. It had one at 7,000 and one at 12. So it's fairly recently been to BMW. That was for a brake fluid and inspection. So it's nice to know that it's fairly recently been to BMW and been inspected and had the brake fluid inspected and then changed. Has it got an application section as well with the apps for e-drive zone and a bunch of other different apps you can go ahead and install as you see fit to the car got a rear facing camera 
front and rear sensors, three selectable drive modes, including hybrid, electric, and then sport. So there is a look around at this superb D20 330e M Sport. If you would like to know anything more, just use the links in the description box for now though. Thanks, bye-bye.